Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to my channel. Welcome to today's video. I am Holly Lenora and today we are going to get this dewy, smooth, fresh, glowy, vibrant look going on. It is spring. Summer is on the way. That's when all the bronze and the glowy looks start start popping up on everybody's news feeds but we're gonna go ahead and get a little head start i just wanted to be a little glowy today so that's what we're doing it's a minimal makeup aside from my base i did do a little bit extra for my base but the eyes i used three shades i didn't smoke out my lower lash line don't forget to subscribe ring the bell hit that thumbs up button and i hope you enjoy the video Okay, we are going to jump right into the good stuff. Moisturize, check. Lumify, check. And y'all know, y'all should be keeping your lips moisturized. I think it is vital. Lip balm, this is a new one. This is my favorite lip balm so far. This one and the Tatcha Kiss You Lip Mask. Those are wonderful lip balms. I put this on every night every morning keeps your lips looking juicy girl okay hydration <sighs> check people sleep on that water man i don't understand why it is so good for you to drink it is so good for your skin for all kinds of stuff keep hydrated if you had to pick one thing to take from this video today i hope that it is stay hydrated in fact go get you a glass of water right now pause the video go get you some water we'll drink it up together okay okay so to stop babbling y'all don't much care for a babbler the youtube watch time shows us everything and we're gonna jump right in so to start we are going to use this mac primer it has little shimmers of glitter in there all right our skin is feeling smooth and soft and a touch tacky now to look glowy and luminous and have that glow from within you either need to be pregnant or ask for a little help from our friends i choose option b okay we are going to go in with this farsali liquid glass radiant skin serum this stuff will run you about I think it's $54 for a, a bottle, but it's so beautiful. It works so well. Oh my gosh. So here we go. Going to place this on our face. And with a beauty blender that is damp, we are going to push that into the skin. And just like that, we are already looking pretty dewy. It looks like we kind of worked up a little sweat. This Lord knows I didn't. Been doing nothing but eating bugles. And the next product we are going to go in with is also Farsali. This is their Rose Gold Skin Serum. And it, once again, Farsali has killed it. Same beauty blender. We are packing on the shine today. Look at that, it's got specks of gold. Can y'all see that? You know we're bougie today. And the last thing we are going to add to our bougie, dewy, glowy skin is another Farsali product. This is their Rose Gold Skin Mist. I need to get some more of this. I think I have a backup. Okay, we have layered on so much glowy goodness. Now it is time for our actual base. I am using a skin tint because I feel with all this glowy, dewy stuff that we put on already, let's let it shine through, baby, okay? This is the Chanel... <laughs> I'm not even gonna try. This is their uh, skin tint. We're just gonna stick with that. I swear, sometimes they put these words on there just to get a good laugh out of us trying to pronounce it. So joke's on you, Chanel. I'm not gonna try to pronounce it. 
I am going to apply this with my It Brushes airbrush number 77 and I am just going to throw some, dang it, my color corrector, jeez, what is the deal? <sighs> Now that that's done with, I don't know why I keep forgetting to do that. Okay, back to Chanel. I'm just gonna throw this right on top of the brush. It's definitely something you need to shake up before you use, just an FYI. Let's go right in. And that is just a thin, light layer of the Chanel blah, blah, blah. Should I add some more? You know what, we're, we're gonna just chill out today and leave it at this and mosey on. For concealer, I am going to go in with another lighter, easy to apply concealer, my little uh, Pokemon ball here, Tatcha's Under Light and Eye Treatment Concealer. This stuff is really starting to grow on me. The first video I featured this in, I really wasn't quite sure. I did a wear test. Mm. But I kept trying it. I honestly wanted to like this. I love Tatcha, so it is growing on me. We're gonna give it another go today. We're just gonna go in with a little. A little goes a long way with this product. And as I've said before, I really, I like how this is just, use your fingers, touch and go, and be on your way. Concealer is on. Today I'm not going to go through with all the brightening stuff because this is glowy and dewy and along with being glowy and dewy I like to kind of incorporate the natural look. So we're, we're going to leave our skin as is. Thank you Tasha. You've done enough for today. Next up we are going to bronze our face. This I cracked this bad boy out today. It has been sitting with all my other makeup stuff. I don't know why. It's not because I dislike Too Faced. I love Too Faced. Get it, girl. But I don't know. I just decided to use it today. What the? The hey? Having nails is a blessing and a curse. Thumbs up if you feel me. This is their dark chocolate matte bronzer. I forgot the word for a second. <sighs> it does not look very dark chocolatey. Especially compared to, I mean, when you see that, you think, oh, that's going to be way too dark. But we are going to go in with it and just do a light dusting, make the threes on our faces. Here we go. You see the difference between a bronzed face and a not bronzed face? It just gives it warmth and, and dimension. And look at my little cheekbones, honey. Okay, thanks, Mom. Bronze at that neck and make sure it's good and blended. Just to keep everything in check, y'all, make sure you blend out your forehead. I forget that. I forget. I just don't blend it out enough quite often. Yes, I know this is a highlighter brush. Okay, now that that is complete, I am going to brush through my brush through. I am going to fast forward, rush through my eyebrow routine. I'm going to use my Morphe stuff that I just got. I've really been loving that. Go Morphe. So I will see you on the other side. going to prime our eyelids with the P. Louise base. Mine is in the shade Rumor 03. I'm just going to go in with my fingers. All right, all right. And for the palette, the palette that I chose for this natural, dewy, glowy, I'm beautiful from within look that we are creating. Give it up for Naked, the Naked Reloaded Urban Decay Boom, we are going to go into this one today. I have all the Naked palettes except for the cherry one. I wasn't, that color story wasn't for me. This one isn't my absolute favorite, but I did get it because 
it was a naked palette, I'll be honest. We aren't going to go too crazy with the eyeshadow, mainly because I just want to stick with the natural colors, barely anything there. We're gonna, we're gonna vibe with that today. It's a beautiful day, it's a great day to go outside and show off your glowiness to who, I don't know, we should all be staying inside, but. So let's go right in for the crease color. I am going to go in with this one. I believe it is called Bucked. Ha, I got it, yes. I am going to take this Morphe 433 and go right in. If you don't have this palette, you could just use a bronzer to do your crease shade. I love that little trick. I've done it in multiple videos. It's awesome. You know, and today, I don't think I'm going to smoke out my lower lash line. <sighs> yeah, I think we're, we're going to stick to that natural look. So, I believe for the next shade, I'm going to go in with this dark brown. This is called End Game. And I'm going to take this smudge brush right here from Morphe. It is the M431. I'm just going to start with a little. Just a little on my brush. Tap off the excess. And I am going to go into my crease about halfway in. I need to zoom y'all in a little bit more. Sorry. Okay, that's better. So we have a little bit on our brush. I am going to go into my crease about halfway and just dust and kind of connect it to the bottom. Make a uh, sideways V, I guess you would say. I'm gonna put it right in my crease with this color. I'm not gonna go above my crease. And I want to push it out just a little. Like I said, we're just dusting this color. A little more. Create a slight wing there. Or you can create a big one, whatever you choose. And now I am going to just take my finger and I want to go into the color. We're gonna go in with Barely Baked right here, the second to last color. All over the lids. Kind of blend it with that shade end game to get rid of any harsh lines, buffing it out. And now let me go ahead and do the other eye and we will finish this look. It's not much now, but just give me time. And to add an extra little touch to our eyes, we are going to use this magic pencil. It is from Morphe. This is in the shade Nude. I just line my lower lash line with this stuff and it really helps to add awakeness and brightness and widen your eyeballs. Okay, to finish off the eyes, we are going to add mascara. I'm not gonna do falsies today just because like I said, I want this look to be very natural, very glowy, very dewy, not, not glam. So I have this mascara from KKW Beauty, and then I also have this Fenty Beauty mascara. I am going to combine these two first. If I don't like that, I brought Miss Pat McGrath in as reinforcements. This is what it looks like with just one layer. That was the Fenty Beauty. So on top of that, I'm gonna go in with this KKW mascara. I think the combination of the two, I'd say they did all right. Um, for my lower lash line, I'm gonna be a little bit extra. And this is my MAC Extended Play Giga Black Lash. I love this for my lower lash line because the brush is so small, works perfectly. You can totally use just a regular old mascara tube. You don't have to get this extra stuff. And that is a wrap for the eyes on this glowy and dewy look. 
Next, we're gonna go in with a little brush. This is from Kylie Cosmetics. It is titled, We're Going Shopping. Mm -hmm. Psych. That is the shade. The undertones in it kind of fit with our theme, fit with my skin. Won't show up too pink, too out there. So we're gonna use that today with my It Brushes Blush Brush. Done for being extra. We are just moving along, people. Okay, what's next? We're gonna go in with highlighter. How can you be glowy and dewy without it? This is Laura Mercier's highlighter palette. It also has blush colors in there. This is what she looks like. I have used this multiple times. It is gorgeous. So we're going to take a smaller fluffy brush. This is the Morphe 501, M501. And I am going with this one right here. Oh, it's got a gold sheen to it. Yes. That goes with our Rose Gold Farsali Skin Mist. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. I love it. Oh man, makeup is fun. Just a little more. It's such a pretty shine. If you guys are sleeping on highlighters, I don't know what to tell you, man. This is beautiful. If you want a highlighter that is friendlier on your wallet wet n wild has a fabulous one i tried that out in my inexpensive makeup video go check that out and also if you have yet to go and enter my giveaway be sure you do it is the sephora ulta haul video just be sure you're subscribed ring the bell leave a comment no wait don't ring the bell subscribe hit the thumbs up leave a comment you can ring the bell if you want to and you will be entered into the giveaway. It has 600 plus dollars worth of beauty goodies in there. Just waiting to, to have a happy home. Matter of fact, let me, hold on. Okay, so before we move on, these bags are full of goodies. These are in the giveaway, hello. Go ahead, go to that video, do what you gotta do, subscribe, thumbs up, comment, and you'll be entered to win it all. Just to recap, it's got this beautiful Sol de Janeiro shampoo conditioner set, Morphe Icy Fantasy Palette, my favorite brush cleaner by Clinique, Glow Recipe Ultra Fine Watermelon Mist, Laura Mercier Face Primer, this is fairly new, Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set Setting Spray, one of my favorite skin serums, this is Tarte's Mermaid of the Sea, Morphe Brushes, ColourPop Palette, Too Faced Mascara, Glow Recipe Banana Souffle Moisturizer, like hello, this is good stuff. Anyway, just wanted to recap, refresh your mind, go into the giveaway, Let's move on to lips. I am going to line my lips with this Morphe Backseat Love Lip Liner. We're gonna overline them just a little today. Next, we are gonna go in with this Morphe, what is this? Uh, I believe it, it looks like a matte liquid lip. Uh, it is in the shade Boho. Haven't used this before, so we'll see. Fingers crossed. Oh no, this is a gloss. But it, it matches our kind of natural theme. We'll keep it. I kind of wanted, I wanted this color, but matte. But, I mean, we'll keep it. She's cute, she's cute. Well, since that is a gloss, we don't need to add this. This is one of my favorite Morphe lip glosses in the shade Pop. Uh, if that would have been a matte lip gloss, I mean a matte, why did my mind just go blank? A matte lip stick. What am I doing? Uh, then I would have covered it up with some gloss just to add a little bit of shine, make those lips look a little bit juicier. But I'm okay with this. Are you okay with this? I hope you're okay with this because this is what we're going with. And to set our faces, we are looking so shiny and 
Ooh, okay, we're gonna go in with this dewy set. It does add a dewy sheen, although we don't need it. We're gonna be extra, so let's go. Okay, everybody, what do we think? Do we look kind of natural, glowy, just ready to take on the day at home? Ready to, to be a girl boss at home? You go do the dishes. Put the toilet seat down. <laughs> yeah, I think that'll work. I think, I think our faces match that vibe. And if we were going outside, getting a little bit of sun, getting a little tan on, it's coming, ladies. Don't worry. We're going to be at the pool sooner than you think. I would have added on one of the two. This is the Sol de Janeiro Coco Cabana Bronze Glow Oil. And this one is from Huda Beauty. This is not your mama's pantyhose. I really want to know the story behind that name. Or do I? This is in the shade Aphrodite. 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 You know what? We're just going to cut that. I'm not sure uh, what, how she wants me to pronounce that. So this is the, uh, I think medium one. And this one is in, you know what? Just forget it. I would have put these two on my body, on my shoulders, on my chest, on my neck, maybe on my arms, you know, and we would have really been glowing it up. But for today, this will do. I'm going to go watch TV now. No, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> OMG. Okay. So thank you so, so much for being here with me today. I hope you enjoyed. Please don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, hit that thumbs up button, and I will see you on the next video. Bye.